last Friday, I retired 39 years. If you ask James Knotts what his proudest moment to date is, he'd show you this, a congressional gold medal. Something that I didn't dream of. I never thought I, I never thought I'd ever get one for, uh, as a former Marine. Members of Congress honored the 92-year-old and 400 former black Marines who called Motford Point in North Carolina home nearly 70 years ago. Mount Point was the only, only place in the United States that, 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 that trained black troops. In 1942, the military allowed blacks to serve in the Marine Corps. At 26, Knotts was among the first African Americans to integrate the system. We, we was colored. We had 12 seconds to anybody that was so difficult to be, be the service workers than anybody else. As a Marine, he traveled the globe, served during World War II as a carpenter and during the Korean conflict. In Washington, D.C., the recognition allowed him to reconnect with his fellow training buddies. I talked to one guy, he was 92, but he was born in February, I was born in December. I was still the oldest. <laughs> before that, I was anywhere last week. I was the oldest one there. His daughter, Carrie, says it was a proud moment that brought her to tears. They were the ones that paved the way. Even though they did it through the Marine Corps, they paved the way so that you could be where you are today. Looking back at a legacy, these men also cherish. It meant a whole lot to me, a lot to me. And Mr. Knotts will be honored tonight for being a medal recipient at Bible Way Church's Dream Center. All are invited to attend. It starts at 7 o'clock. I'm Tim Pulliam. Now back to you.